Good day everybody and welcome back to another Starfield Tips and Tricks video. I've just got to say a massive thank you for all the support. At the time of recording this we're at 202 subscribers. Just absolutely didn't expect this at all. So thank you everybody who's engaged on the channel and who's following me so far. I do hope you'll all stick around. Uh, for a lot more content coming up including a lot of uh, VR content coming soon as well. So today's video we're going to get into a uh, little bit of a trick where you can earn basically infinite credits. Um, you don't need a lot for this. Uh, you need your uh, you need a ship basically or a couple of ships anyway. Um, so you need to get two ships that you don't mind um, changing within your inventory. Uh, if you want to do that then either come to like an outpost that you've got and on a landing pad or go to any ship vendor doesn't matter where they're located whether they're on the quay whether they're at new aquila uh, new atlantis or aquila city it doesn't matter uh, and then what we're going to do is if you don't have two ships go ahead and just buy a couple so that they're all registered to you and then we're going to go into the ship builder and we're going to add as many fuel tanks uh, HE3 tanks as you can now obviously it's better if you've got um, Starship Design 4 here I'm only up at Starship Design level 2 um, Starship Design level 4 will give you bigger helium 3 tanks uh, so you'll be able to get more money effectively from it uh, the way to do this basically is with the ship duplication glitch so we've got a ship here which we've got UC Vanguard Raptor and we've got a ship here as well um, which is the other UC Vanguard Raptor now as we can see here um, we've got plenty of helium 3 tanks on this and we're going to go ahead and press LB and X at the same time Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. You've got to get it just right. I didn't get it right that time. So let's see if that works. So then all you've got to do once you've got it is move a piece of the item or the ship or delete a piece. Save it. And that didn't work. So we're going to go again. So, as you can tell, it took a little while there um, for me to get it. I'll run it through anyway. Um, but effectively now what we've got is we've got the same ship on slot 1 and slot 8. Uh, and then we're going to go into um, slot 1 here. So I'm going to go move back to my mouse and keyboard here. Uh, so we can do this a lot quicker. So we're going to go into the ship builder. And then we're just going to go ahead and delete all these parts. Now as you can see on the top right hand side we are getting a cash value for them obviously not as much as we paid for them originally um, but that doesn't matter because you're going to continue to be able to do this. So every time we do this we're getting 54,315 okay um, so as you can tell now that ship one is now empty ship 8 is now my modify ship so if we want to do it the other way around we use RB and X which may well be a bit easier let's find out yep so for me it's easier for me to do RB and X rather than LB and X but it all depends on what you guys want to do um, and then you just repeat the process um, so as you can see we've got it in uh, slot 8 and slot 1 repeat the process and just get infinite credits if you run out of credits with your vendor or on your star pad then just go and sleep go to Venus sleep for six hours and just rinse and repeat well I hope guys that was helpful I will be covering more videos I'm having a, a, an upcoming video about weapons coming out shortly um, so I hope you'll stick around guys if you do like the content please do consider a like and a subscribe it's completely free to you guys and I'm hoping we can get to 250 maybe even 300 stretch goal for the end of the year that would be amazing 
guys as always i hope everybody has a good day